Okay, Evan, thank you so much for reaching out to me. You said you wanted a review of your Facebook page, so let's do it. First of all, your heading picture, I like it, it's good, but quite honestly, there could be some sort of, uh, the heading should be darkened up a little bit. Um, I um, think with a intriguing or benefit-rich headline, something like a VIP service at an affordable rate, or something of that nature, something that gets the person, whoever clicking on your Facebook page, actually gives them some value. Um, you got to think in what is it in for me? And that's what is it in for the customer, right? Um, I'm showing you, I'm showing your boxes. That's good. A good, clean, loaded truck. That's awesome. I like that. But uh, I would darken it up and then with an, a dark overlay with, uh, the, with some sort of benefit rich um, headline on it. And then maybe over here, um, here in the lower right-hand corner, maybe a QR code for anybody that's looking on desktop so that they can scan um, a scan a page or reviews or something like that, um, some, something of that nature. Okay, then you've got your mix and movers here in the little circle tab. Um, that's great. Um, let, me at, let me just check. I'm going to click this headline. All right, so when I click on the, the heading picture, You've got the heading picture here, and that's great. But here in the comment section, you could actually write something. If you go over here, you can click those three buttons, and then you can actually write in an e uh, do something. So you could say, give like a special discount for if they click on the picture. Hey, congratulations for clicking the picture. Uh, for doing so, here's uh, $50 off or something like that. Right? So, or here, download this free PDF or this free checklist or something. Give them something to uh, click when they do that. Um, did you do it here? Um, all right. See profile picture. See, you could do that same thing with the profile picture. You can actually write something here um, and actually edit this um, and, and so on and so forth. So I, I would do something like that with those pictures, right? Give If they click on the picture, because some people are going to do it, but give them like a, a little uh, Easter egg, as they call it. Right, that's awesome. This intro, um, the intro is pretty good, providing affordable and reliable moving and delivery solutions to the best of our ability. Um, I wouldn't put a best of our ability. That actually kind of like, that's kind of a a negative. Um, but I like the providing. I would see what I could do. I would probably go to Chat GPT if I could go to Chat GPT and to see and have Chat GPT give them some prior parameters and see how they can literally really spruce that up and make it a little bit more uh, clickbait. You want people to do it. So obviously the call to action is call you. So I would tell them what to do. So uh, I would give them the little intro like you did, which is awesome. I like the, I like how it's punchy. It's only a, a sentence or two, but then when I give them a call to action, like call, I would say call now, boom, 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 right? Your phone number. So that's very good. Um, the subscriber hood, I look at the subscriber hood, um, and then it goes, why would I want to be a subscriber? That just, I mean, I don't see any reason. You're not giving me any reason to be a subscriber. I'm not going to pay you $5 a month uh, to be a subscriber because you're not giving me any value to do so. So I, I don't know why you have that. Now you can, if you're given some sort of value, um, like if they subscribe, they can get like discounts or you can you know, some freebies or something like that may, that might be worth it, but right now there's nothing there. So I get rid of that. And not only that, when you go hit the subscriber, hut, it takes you off your Facebook page. So you got to go and hit the back button to get back to it. About section, uh, contact information. It's got your address, the areas you work in, your phone number, your star rating, good minority owned. That's awesome. That's also, so that's always a selling point. Always open. No, you're not always open. So actually put some sort of uh, time when you're actually open. Price range, um, okay. Um, then it's got some reviews, gives you some of the services, your phones. Um, I like that. Let's check on basic moves, basic moves. Hey, if you're a labor only, why are you offering a truck? That's actually illegal. Did you, you know, if you're a labor only and you do not have commercial insurance or authority, that's actually illegal. And you put not only yourself at risk, but your customer stuff at risk. Now, if you know, uh, if you can help deliver a moving truck that they rent, 
like a U-Haul truck or Penske truck, that's fine. But if you're, why are you offering a truck for, why does that include a truck? That doesn't make sense. You're labor only. Um, and if you're, and if you're not, don't have the authority of a full service mover, you're actually, uh, you're actually violating the law. So I wouldn't do that. Um, cause if, cause New York will check that kind of stuff. So you might want to check that furniture delivery, uh, contact us for a free quote. No, I wouldn't say contact. Th that's okay. But why, why would they want to, you know, I see, um, let's just go back. See, in a basic move, you've got this, you've got this great, um, great, uh, thing here, not taking it, not taking everything, only need a few items. You should do the same thing with furniture delivery. You should give some sort of preamble and then contact us now for a free quote. Um, and I like that you got the message business. Let me check something while I'm here. Message business. Okay. Um, can I move my thing here? Um, oh, I'm interested. Can you tell me more? Oh, okay. Um, what services do you offer? Okay. Um, you can actually set up a chat bot and I would actually do that if I were you set up a chat bot that it will actually take them like through all your common questions and so on and so forth. And you can actually make it a smart bot. So if they say, if like it, it's for instance, if they answer this way, then it will go to this way. Um, and you could do that. And you can also set it up through chat GPT and AI. Um, you, so you could actually make this really powerful um, and to do most of your work for you. Uh, that's good. So mentions, okay, blah, 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 reviews. Um, do you do you recommend Mixon's move? Yep, I like that. Okay, good. You got 78 reviews. That's really good. You probably need to work on that more. Um, get more reviews. And you have 4.8. That's really good. That means there's, out of all those 78s, you probably got one or two people that were just a-holes um, or, you know, just could not be, no matter what happened, they just, can't be satisfied and that happens or maybe you just flat screwed up on those moves that happen those happens too services again we went through the services already i like that um i would uh there's actually a lot more services especially with junk moval and and things like that that you could do uh you know for instance couch moving piano moving um you know couch removal you know not just junk removal but individual pieces and you can charge by an individual piece. Did you know that? So if someone's want to get rid of a couch, you can say good couch removal. Uh, and, uh, that will help. And this will load up. So I like that videos, lies, followers, check-ins, reviews. Okay. All in all, that's pretty good. I like that. Um, you're featured. I've looked through your featured. I like the meet your crew. Um, most likely to climb, most likely to be late. See, I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't say most likely to be late because now your customers are going to come in and say, oh, he's going to be late. I don't want people being late. I'm expecting another one. Most likely to sleep through his alarm. I like how they're funny. I like that you're given, you know, I like how they're they're funny and their stuff. But that also gives a, a bad taste in your customer's mouth. So I would change that so that they're not, not may, maybe most likely to fall down on their, uh, on their skateboard or something like that, you know, most likely to drop their wallet in the toilet or, or something like you can still be funny, but not have it where the connotation is like they're late or sleep through their alarms. That's, that's bad for you thing. You remember your, I, but I do like the whole meet the crew and how it's funny, how it's, uh, you know, I like that. I really do. It gives character. It shows charisma. I like that. I like this move with confidence. And I really like the use of uh the i uh the emojis you use them well um i like the thing i would uh put a little why choose mixes moving i would put a little space there proven expertise tailored service top-notch care great um good i like that because those are those are benefit rich um they're not they're not features they're bet you got the feature and then you give a you know the benefit so that's really good i like that our services boom 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 good out of contact good um, contact us with the phone number, leave a message. Um, try to just try to stick to one call to action. Hey, you know, ready to make your move memorable. I love that for all the right reasons. Perfect. No, that's great. That's a great little con contact us today in here or send us a message. 
People already, you're out, they're already in Facebook. They already know I wouldn't put that there. It confuses them on a confused mind is, uh, does not buy. So I do like this, uh, my, this collage of photos. I like that. Really, really do like that. That's an amazing feature. Um, I like all the photos. Here's what I would improve. One is the header, right? Get some sort of a punchy, uh, benefit rich, uh, headline here in the picture. Uh, again, dark, you know, put in a dark overlay, tran dark transparent overlay over this picture with a nice punchy headline that's benefit rich. But another thing that you should be doing is you should be, um, you should have a link to a Google, Google My Business page and a Google website. Those are all free. There's no reason why you don't have a website, um, but that'll also help with your SEO. Um, and if you, and then on your Google My Business, can you can link back to your Facebook. So they really become like this back and go. This is a great thing for your labor only. You don't have to have a website, but this is, and this is a great example of what you could do when you don't have a website. Here's what I would do more. I would show pictures of um, of you with your customers or your crew with your customers. Get a sign made up, uh, you know, a nice little sign that says, I had the best move with Mixon's moving, right? And so have your crew with the customer and have a, a with a selfie in front of a truck or the loaded truck, right? Boom. I had, you know, so that, so you they're getting a picture with the customer. So you're showing, you're showing actual people being done. Um, I would get, I would highlight uh, the reviews more. So I'd probably get, if you can get your customers to do a video review that you could put on Facebook, right? Um, may, and some helpful uh, articles that you could go, you can use chat GPT to write some articles for you. They don't have to be long, but you know, um, things that would, uh, people would be interested with their home, you know, how to, if they're moving out of, um, an apartment, how do they get their deposit up their, uh, apartment deposit back, you know, how to move with dogs and animals and kitty cats and all that good stuff and have some articles. I would create some articles on here. Right. Um, and you could put those in the featured area, some things like that. Um, so you could actually have a, a lot more featured posts that would do, uh, that you could do that actually have helpful articles thing. I would also have, um, like I said, I would have posts of people giving video testimonials, um, not just uh, your reviews. And I would have signs with uh, my customers in front of my truck and with our crew. So I have one crew take the picture or something like that. And you're with the customer. They're holding up a sign saying, I had the best move with mix in movers. So I want people want to see more. They they're going to want to see um, like reviews are very important. They're going to actually want to see you with your customers. Um, the stuff that you have here is phenomenal. It's amazing. I love it. Um, I would uh, I would take screenshots of my reviews and put them on. So if you go here, you could go to your review and you could take a screenshot of this, right? Um, and then put that on your timeline. Another thing you need to do is start actually responding to your customers, whether it's good or, pop or negative. Um, say, hey, thanks a lot, Thomas. We really appreciated working with you. You made the, you made our job so much better. We appreciate you. If you know anybody else, have them click this. Have them click this link, which is a link to your photo from up here, right? That gives them, that gives them a, a discount that they can, or have a download where they can download a couple of coupons that they can give to friends and family. You, you know what I'm saying? And then they can give that to our friends and family. And you just, and you want to make sure that you communicate each with every single one of your guys. That's going to bring, bring, because people, you know, if they're taking the time to leave a review, you should take the time to, to respond to that review, good or bad. Right. Um, other than that, man, you have a really good Facebook uh, profile here. Um, just some slight tweaks, some things I would do. Um, I, if you're not getting the, if you're not getting, um, people uh, coming off, it's probably most likely because one, um, again, you're not given a call to action and these are small and hard to read, especially if they're on a mobile device. And most people are, when they come to this, they're going to go, they're looking for a website, right? Um, 
So you could set up Google to do most of that as a website. It's really easy, simple, easy peasy. So you could use that as a website. So that's what they're looking for. Um, so it, I don't know if you have a website or not, but that's what they're looking for. Other than that, it's a it's a good. It, this will work right now, but it looks like you you know that you should actually be upgrading and actually having your own website actually built or using a free Google website and then using Google My Business and really optimizing that. But other than that, I don't really see much anything doing. You you look happy. Your crew looks fine. You know, uh, you you know they got the, in the meet the crew. You got your girlfriend. It looks like which is awesome. Um, you guys look like your thing. Another thing you want to do is probably get some uniform shirts, um, hoodies, ball caps, and then start having your, pe your people in actually uniform. So when they show up, they're showing up in uniform. And when you got, when we've got a picture they're see like this, you're, you're, I think that's you. I can't, I'm blind. So pardon me. I'm not trying to be offensive, but I think that's you. You should be in a uniform shirt. Right, this guy should be in a uniform shirt, not a you, you know, not a Dragon Ball Z shirt. Um, everybody should be in a uniform, so that'll just give you a little bit more professionalism, right? Um, you see here, you you got this nice hoodie. You should it should be a uniform hoodie, um, and there's a lot of things you could do. But other than that, it's just small things, small, uh, really tiny tweaks overall. Um, if I were to give you a grade on this, I'd give you, uh, I'd probably give you an A to an A minus, right? Um, but other than that, man, you're doing great. Keep it up. Thanks a lot for asking me to do this. I appreciate that. And, um, you know, uh, let's uh, get done with that. All right. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.